guys, today I'm reviewing the DX Sound Attack Godzilla 2004. So first you have this really nice photo of him. <laughs> All sorts of stuff going on in the background. Like lasers, like codes and stuff. I don't know, it's Japanese. They always go the extra mile with packaging. And it says it in Japanese and also in English. Going on to the other side, it shows you how to use it. It says 50th anniversary. And the back, you got all these shots of him, like that, that, that. It shows you what you could do. On the other side, more pictures and on the bottom I could barely fit this box in here we got sad pac-man <laughs> and also dx sound attack godzilla and more weird codes and stuff happening and all this legal stuff in japanese <laughs> there you got the box not time for opening it. And here's Godzilla that's inside. Very, very nice detail. It's like the normal Final Wars Godzilla toy, but has rubbery and bigger, scaled up. And what I love about this is it looks more like this suit than the movie because the suit is all rubbery. The only articulation is the mouth and the arms. And you got nicely detailed spines going all the way to the tail. Very nice detail. Mine has a little crack here, but I fixed it. But it's okay. All of them are different. And very nice from the front, very ferocious looking. And also, now time for the stuff that he does. So first, you want to pull this up. And he does that. And if you want to open his mouth and make him roar, this is actually a button here. And you press it down. And the, it's very nicely painted. They didn't miss any spots at all. Like no overspray. Or, yeah. And you see his tongue. Tongue is transparent. And that's for softening out. And for to simulate stomping, you just. Just like that. And now, make it like he's punching buildings. And here's the back of him. Very nicely sculpted. Oh yeah, and I forgot there's articulation here. I can go full. 360, but it kind of loosens it a bit if you do that. And now, time for the atomic breath. Go. And then, when it's done charging, See it from this side. And 
from the back. And then Just like that. It's a very nice toy. You can do a lot of stuff with it. Not very particular, but that's for electronics. And inside, there's like a structure in there. And these little holes kind of look like there's a guy in there looking out, outside of it. I don't know if you can see. There's little holes there. That's obviously where the speaker is, but it kind of looks like a guy in a suit. On the side, too. Looks very nice. Oh, this is coming off. It came in the package with the arms off. You have to put them on from the front view. Just like that other side in the back and overall very nicely sculpted very beautiful figure very ferocious looking and that's my review of the DX Sound Attack Godzilla 2004 see you later